I'll get out to Aaron here. Um, just missed the, um, the fastest speed we, we had, have ever had. It was up to 230 kilowatts, up to the 60%. But obviously the charge doesn't um, stay at the same rate through the, uh, through the battery um, recharge cycle. So once it hits 60, it does go down. Um, but very exciting to get 230 kilowatts per hour, which is significantly faster than I had before. It's a, a hot day here. We're in we're in New York. Just drove down from Toronto. So first time charging in in the US. And yeah, the uh, Electrify America chargers are better quality, as you can see, than the ones in, in Canada or in Ontario, anyways. So it's about 30 degrees today. So the battery's nice and warm. Um, perfect charging. Um, uh, situation scenario so the um we've, we've had we're having a lot faster than we, we've ever had before um ontario doesn't have many 350 kilowatt charges only the ones in petro canada which i've never been able to get working past 50 kilowatts um and on facebook groups and stuff from for ionic 5 this does seem to be some sort of maybe software issue but um the electrify america first up for straight away was charging at 230 kilowatts which was very exciting so another six minutes here at this speed to 80%, which is a lot faster than what the 50 kilowatt we were charging at earlier today over on the other, on Ontario, the other border. So, uh, yep, very excited to see faster speeding, which really makes it as a game changer for the Ionic 5.